Hey, how's it going, everybody? Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com, and welcome to the update for Friday, October 16th, 2020. Free pick coming up in college football. We'll get to that in just a moment. Hey, listen, I hope you're with me, and thanks to those of you who were with the premium picks on my Handicappers homepage on Thursday as we swept. We went 3-0, 2-0 in the PGA, which extends our run now to 25-13, 66% since the 1st of August. We've picked up almost $4,000 for $100 per unit betters. Couple the three-star winners. Real nice, easy winner right out of the gate. Boy, we loved it when uh, Xander Schauffele was on his game start to finish and defeated Victor Hovland in our matchup by nine strokes. It was a real nice 2-0 day. I'm in PGA action on Friday, second round play out here at the CJ Cup at Shadow Creek and uh, right here in Las Vegas. And I do have a four-star play and we're playing with the book's money this tournament after going 2-0 yesterday. Four-star matchup available on Friday on my Handicappers homepage. It's a Friday afternoon matchup. Let's make it three and oh let's extend that run to 26 and 13 over the last two plus months also one in baseball i had one premium pick yesterday it was the first five innings under four and a half between the dodgers and the braves and uh, we cashed the teams combined for two runs it was one one after five uh, we trusted the rookie pitcher for the braves and he got the job done for us so very happy with that Overall baseball run is now 11 and five, our last 16. And our high-end plays, which are those rated five stars and higher, they're down nine and three, our last 12, up over $3,600 for $100 per unit betters. And I've got a six-star play going in Friday's action. So don't miss out on that, man. If you want to jump on board, it's available at DocSports.com on my Handicappers homepage, six-star play in Major League Baseball on Friday. We've got the PGA four-star. I've also got two plays in soccer. We've been passing most of this week. Uh, but we've got a Friday afternoon play, and I've got an early Saturday morning side, uh, both available on one package right now at DocSports.com. All right, let's get to the free pick for today. And we're looking at some college football action here. And again, here's what I want to tell you, first of all. I don't like either of tonight's games, Friday night's college football games. Not even enough to even talk about an opinion. So we're not going to go there. We don't force plays just because they're on TV, right? So we're going to look at an early Saturday game. And it's the battle between Liberty and Syracuse. And Liberty laid about a field goal in this game. And here's the thing. I know some who are on Syracuse are going to say that, you know, this is a step up, <clears throat> excuse me, step up in pedigree for Liberty. I get it. I get that argument. But it's a nice revenge setup also for Liberty. You'll remember they lost last year's game. Uh, Hugh Freeze was the first game, I believe it was, and he was basically watching from a hospital bed in that particular game. But he's got the goods on offense to get the job done here. I don't think Syracuse is going to struggle as badly offensively as they did, let's say, against North Carolina and against Pitt. But I also don't think they're going to keep up with Liberty. This Liberty off, excuse me, offense, sorry about that, guys, is uh, right now uh, playing extremely well. They're averaging almost 34 points per game on the season. They've got a quarterback who can run for seven yards per pop, who can throw the ball effectively. And you've also got some other skill position players. They've got a running back out of the backfield who can make grabs. Uh, they've got a long distance threat at the wideout position. And Syracuse is not exactly healthy on the offensive side of the football, including their quarterback, Tommy DeVito. So it's a situation here where I think Liberty is going to be too strong offensively. Again, I don't think Syracuse is going to be held in check the way they were against North Carolina and Pitt, but I just don't think they can keep up. And I think the line is quite fair if you like Liberty. In fact, uh, probably should have made this a premium pick. So anyway, free pick on Liberty minus the points over Syracuse. And yes, I will be right back here late Friday night with another play, a free pick from Saturday's college football. Also a reminder, Friday afternoon, Rafael Esparza and I will be talking about the pros versus versus Joe's in this week's NFL. We'll also have a free pick on the clash between the Packers and the Buccaneers, all available on Friday afternoon. So anyway, also wanted to mention real quick, eight football plays for the weekend. None of my football plays go until Saturday. I do have that seven-star play in Saturday college football that leads the way. I've got a six-star play in this week's NFL. Saturday, Sunday, and Monday football included in the package, eight plays at all. All right, if you like the videos, click on that thumbs up button and be sure to subscribe. I do appreciate those who have done so thus far. I'm Scott Spritzer, DocSports.com. Let's put Friday in the win column.